So every session, we uh, ask you guys questions about your use uh, of AI. And I can't tell you how powerful this data is. We've been sharing it with um, you know, the county, with media organizations. Um, your use of AI, uh, the, this, the set of poll data that we're collecting uh, as we ask these questions uh, is one of the largest and most robust there is. And we really appreciate your uh, responses. And one of the things, and, and you have uh, every reason to be really proud of this, um, the amount of usage uh, of uh, AI in business among the folks who attend these webinars uh, is nearly, is over 95% by the end of the uh, first season of masterclasses. That's compared to a national average of 11%. And so the speed of adoption and your usage of AI is truly inspiring. It's trend setting. And it shows how just having these inspiring masterclasses uh, where we introduce you to the tools and experts who teach you how to use them can have a, a dramatic increase uh, in, the na in the usage of it. 91% um, of you reported uh, by the end of our last season that you um, were using AI in your business. That was compared to about 67% when we started and the national average for small businesses of 11%, according to a GoDaddy survey. And even more exciting to me is that um, we saw an increase uh, in by 14 percentage points uh, of the number of you who reported saving or making money using AI. This is, you know, the most important question to us is, are you using AI to save uh, resources or to make more revenue? And today's session around business development is 100% about helping you uh, make more money using AI. Um, and we heard some really great um, feedback and comments about um, how these masterclasses help, have helped you uh, understand some of the nuances and complexities of these tools, um, normalize their use, make you realize that, you know, you're, yes, you're not behind, this is brand new, um, and uh, you can do this too. And um, also, you know, we put a real emphasis in bringing in a diverse set of experts uh, and leveraging those experts um, and uh, really appreciate what Aria Hill had to say about that, about um, not being afraid to address some of the, um, you know, bias issues that come up uh, within AI, particularly facial recognition, but, um, you know, all of these tools, you know, that's a perspective that we've been focused uh, put some focus on and, and get your appreciation about it.